Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, it's spring in Kyoto and that means the cherry... Ow! Ow, don't let it in. But... Anyway, that means that the cherry blossoms are on. They are blossoming in um, not only Kyoto, but the whole, yeah, Japan as well. So today I would like to take you out to maybe a lesser known spot for sakura and um in kyoto so yeah just come along with me um before i go to that spot i am gonna run some errands and take you with me while i do that To get a credit card for some reasons, I mean, I don't even know, but I mean, I can guess a few reasons why I'm still So, so um, I hope that my change now soon because I got some recommendations from friends on what uh, banks to use and what credit card maybe I can get. So, I'm gonna try and. and Probably for a lot of people back home, it's pretty shocking to see how much, um, how everything is wrapped separately in bakeries. Like in Belgium, everything will be like, will be serviced by someone in the bakery and even it's like self-service. I guess for hygienic measures, they like wrap up everything separately. Um, that's a bit crazy, but um, good stuff though. Plastic and more plastic. Well, yeah, that's just how it is. Japanese style hot dog. Tadakimasu.
They're very nice too. Uh, before I left I said it was maybe one of the more lesser known um, places in, in Kyoto to see something else, but who am I kidding there's like no lesser known places in, in Kyoto anymore to watch anything really so it was a little busy mostly on the outside like at the temple itself but once you were inside it was not too bad and people were I mean weren't that many people it's really nice, there were beers, you could drink and you could sit down on little benches and really enjoy the cherry blossoms so I think this was my first time paying for um, yeah, to enter any place really where that has cherry blossoms so but it was a good experience and it was actually really really fun so and there's a car coming so I should stop watching uh, filming now, bye!